Hey everyone, this is Captain Chris from The Speckled Truth. Just want to take a minute and talk about the different swim bait hook styles and pairing those with different soft plastics uh, to be more effective when you're fishing around grass or vegetation situations. Having a couple of different swim bait hook styles is pretty optimal. The first is the uh, EWG or the extra wide gap uh, hook profiles. And as you can see from the tip of the hook to the belly has an extremely wide gap, obviously with the coil spring keeper on the front end. Uh, the other ones, uh, they, they make a couple of different variety, but they're not as pronounced. Uh, this isn't an EWG, but you can see that it's much less in comparison in terms of the actual distance from the hook point to the belly of the, belly of the hook. So why is that important? When you're choosing a different hook uh, soft plastic profile, uh, you'll, you'll notice in a lot of these different uh, soft plastics, they'll actually have a little cavity in the belly of the bait to allow that hook to come through the actual bait itself upon hook set. Uh, some soft plastics don't have those. So like this Egret 5-inch uh, wedge tail, it doesn't uh, have that. So having an extra wide gap hook uh, gives you a little bit more space when that fish takes or you go to set the hook, you have a little bit more hook penetration coming through the top end of the bait. Um, when you're fishing with your swim baits like this Slayer Inc. SST, uh, it does have the actual split and body cavity. So throwing some paddle tail soft plastics um, that's when you can choose to get away with one of those smaller gaps. And then obviously you'll still see the hook pronunciation on the back end of the bait. The biggest thing though is, is trying to match that profile uh, to the actual soft plastic itself. So if I paired this soft plastic, this SST, uh, with one of those EWG hooks, you'd see a, a huge pronunciation on the bottom half of the bait. Um, and then like for this uh, K Wiggler Willow tail, it also, it's kind of like that Egret Wedge tail, which is a great bait to fish in a soft plastic situation, but you can see it doesn't necessarily have uh, the cavity on the belly of the bait. So getting away with one of these extra wide gap hooks, either a 3 aught or a 2 aught, uh, is good because again, once that fish takes the bait, it'll, it'll basically allow that, that hook to expose itself on the back end of the bait. So again, this is just a quick thing that to consider, especially when you're fishing uh, different soft plastic profiles and throwing those around vegetation. So as you go to the tackle aisle, looking at different soft plastics, and you and you know that you want to throw those in a in a certain situation, take a look at different swim bait hooks and try to pair those um, to get better efficiency. So until next time, guys, tight lines. God bless. Hope this is helpful. Take care.